Local News 8 in the morning continues. Hey, welcome back. It's now 657. Here are your three things to know this morning. Number one, new details released by Moscow police reveal that there were other friends of the victims at the home where the murders took place. The 911 call was made from one of the roommates phones, but they would not reveal who made the call. There are still no suspects in custody and police have not located a murder weapon. Number two, former Teton High School wrestling and football coach Jeff Wilkes was arrested, arrested in Blackfoot with two charges of sexual battery of a minor. The alleged assault happened back in 2017 between Wilkes and a 17 year old student. And number three, the Pocatello Animal Services Holiday Pet Food Drive starts today and it runs through December 27th. The shelter is collecting wet or dry dog food and cat food, pet treats, litter, toys and other pet supplies. There are several drop off locations around Pocatello. We can find these stories and more on our website, localnews8.com, or on our app. Let's check back in with Jeff. Okay, we've got a pretty good start around here with some bright conditions. It's going to be cold, and you'll see the sunshine around here. Here's how things begin as you head out the door maybe this morning, 7 to 10 degrees. You've got to go to work. I know some kids are out of school today, and if you're sending your kids to school uh, and there's nobody there, then uh, I'm, I'm not sure what the bus driver's thinking. Uh, 25 at noon and about 28 for the afternoon. It's going to be right around freezing, so some bright sunshine. Look at the wind chills this morning. This is right now, so it feels like it's below zero in Idaho. Falls it feels like about 20 below in Jackson and about 10 degrees below in Salmon. Forecast for our week ahead lays out like this a bit warmer continually. Shower chance Wednesday, turkey time. You better watch your back, Tom. It's going to be 34, and then the clouds begin to break for some sun. It will still be in the teens and about 20 degrees into the overnights. And again, uh, uh, Thanksgiving Thursday. You're kind of scrawny. I, I'm not sure that maybe may next year for you there, bucko. Uh, let's get into Idaho Falls. It'll be 30 and right around uh, freezing for tomorrow. We'll see temps in the singles for some of us. Uh, wind chills will be definitely below that. So still cold. We're about 10 degrees below average for this time of the year with our highs. And normally we should be in the upper 20s at night. So uh, with that being said, it looks like Thanksgiving will be partly sunny and right around to freezing and good football watching weather on 8 and 3 and 5 and every other channel we own here that is broadcasting the pigskin. It'll be 37 on end of Friday. So here's your assignment in five words. <laughs> in five, oh, this ought to be fun. Ruin Thanksgiving. Oh boy. In five words. 208-534-9957. Just let us hear it and we'll analyze these at noon. <laughs> All right. Let us know. We'll see you then.